Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Elix. We're going to go talk to him. I'm actually curious as to what's down this path. Isn't this, didn't this lead us to the pit? I feel like it did. So I'm not positive. There's a whole bunch of junk over here. It's so like that's a thing. I know there's usually people coming and going from this little storage area. Bringing stuff into town and then returning. I feel like I've already looted everything from here. Alright, I'm up on the roof. I don't see any arrows or quivers or anything. Yes, that is the pit over there. Well, whatever. We'll, we'll come back this way a little bit later. I do want to go in there, but we can either jump in from the top like we did before, or if we end up finding ourselves back down this way, uh, maybe we'll go around the side again and we'll jump in if they won't just let us in through the front. So, All right, let's, sp let's speak to Mr. Drogue. Drogue, time you learn to keep your mouth shut. Nah, about your friend. About your friend Alvar. What about him? Where is he? He should be standing guard. How should I know? He comes and goes as he pleases. But if you're going to start looking for him, try the tavern. Ask Oren, the tavern keeper. He could have seen Alvar. Huh. Right. Okay. Well, Drog, or Drog, or whatever your name is, you get to chill. So, tavern. Did I ever get everything I wanted out of this building? I feel like I didn't. Don't think you can steal anything here. Don't think you can steal anything here. I do think that I can steal things here, but not while you're here. Well, you I need you steal, to leave. You die. Yeah, I don't think I die. I think you just get really mad, and then I run from you, and then you look like the fool. That's my guess to how all that would go down. Well, it just pulls boxes out of wood piles. It's amazing. Alrighty, I guess we'll come over here. There's a worker in my way, a ah, cultivator. What news from the fields? You hear Yoris still looking for volunteers to go up to the converter? Good luck to him. I don't know anyone who's going to risk that journey in a hurry. Me? I will? No. Uh, let's see, do you know a berserker named Mr. Alvar? Do you know a berserker named Alvar? Oh yeah, I know Alvar. That asshole almost tore down <gasps> half the tavern with his friend Argor a few days ago. Those two drink harder than anyone I've seen drink for a long time. I haven't seen Alvar since. If you find him, you tell him not to show his face in here again. Do you know where Alvar could be? No, and I don't want to. You could ask his drinking buddy Argor, down at the pit. He's about the only one talking to Alvar uh, these days. Irony. Okay. Well, apparently, I'm going to be going to the pit, which is where I just thought it's... It's it's a little it's a little ironic and funny that that's how this all just went down. But you know what? I will accept it and I will move on. I think I can just leap over here. This should, if I'm getting the lay of the town right, put me right out where I want to be. Oh, by the way, I noticed this before and I I, I tried it. It didn't work. Again, I was messing around getting like used. I was doing like dodge rolls and, and trying like quick aiming and stuff. And I noticed that I could do this. And I can actually aim and shoot with my bow, and it uses stuff way, 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 way less. So that's cool. That's a cool little feature. I, I'm almost 100% sure that I tried it before while I was flying, and it did not let me aim. I. Alright, let me. I am 100% sure I did. I don't know why it didn't work. Maybe I didn't have arrows in my. Uh, equipped or uh, loaded into the bow and I just wasn't able to do it. It could have been something as simple as that, but that's a really cool feature and I do like that and it does slow down combat just a bit. Now, I don't believe the lock-on feature is there for that, so eh, it's just going to be different. But it's another tool in our quiver. Eh? Eh? Up, you can stop there. Entry into the pit is only for authorized personnel. It's our I'm looking for a guard called Alvar. Well, you won't find him here. So, be on your way. Alvar is needed on duty. Elder sent me. Uh, has he skipped duty again? I'm afraid I haven't seen him for a few days. Last time I saw him, we had a real session. 
He had some really hard stuff with him. <laughs> I woke up next day out of the balcony of Ragnar's stronghold. That's the I have no idea warlord, where Alvar right? went. All I know is we caused some real trouble. My wife's still not speaking to me. <laughs> Should I check the area around Ragnar's fortress then? Sure, you can do that. Well, that just kind of seemed like a cop out. Yeah, I'm sure you can do that. Do whatever you want. Just get out of my face. I don't care. Well, you know what, buddy? I care. That's that's what I care. Also, here's another thing that I had noticed. Uh, you can't actually pull out a weapon while you're jumping around. Like if you're in midair and you're a ju jump jet, jumping jetty thingy that you do, you cannot actually withdraw a weapon. Neither the melee nor the ranged. So you have to get that beforehand. What's this? It's a sulfur vein. Cool. Alright, so I believe there was a bunch of stuff in here that we could have looted, but I didn't. Mostly because I'm a terrible human person. No. Mostly because I wasn't stealing stuff. I wasn't all about the thievery back then. But now that I can get away with it, I am all about the thievery again, folks. It's what I do. Sometimes. Like right now, it's what I do. Is that another... That's a sulfur nugget. Alright. What's this thing? A jackhammer? What do you do with a jackhammer? Is that a weapon? It sounds like it could be. Nope. Nope. Aw, it makes me sad. How close am I to the war bow? I'm not. I mean, I'm getting there, I guess, slowly. Get some Alexit, some more antitoxin. What's this thing? A movement detector? Oh, I completed a quest I didn't know I was on. I got drone control. Interesting. Couldn't I fix the drone with all this stuff I just picked up? I feel like I could have. I'm not seeing a whole heck of a lot in here. There's some Alexit there. Maybe another little metal thing to our right. That might just be part of the machine. Nope, yeah, that's part of the machine. Well, I, I guess that's that. I don't think there's anything else that we can loot that I'm seeing. So that's pretty cool. We got a whole bunch of random stuff. So quest-wise, I'm still a little confused with some of the things. But we haven't really been looking at the quests running. Free as a bird. I'm under threat for pretty much everyone. Allies from the Middle Ages. Assimilating foreign property. Get better equipment. Yeah, I know. Uh, a berserk. Uh, the berserker Duras seems not to recognize me and wants to help people. Okay, I need assistance, and he could be good support. Maybe I can get him as an actual thing. Uh, Drog needs someone to knock some sense into him. I'm not quite there yet. Cultivator Eldor is worried about. Okay, so this is kind of our quest, and if we hit. Z, I think it marks it to the map. Corrin lost his weapons while escaping some creatures here. I should get it back for him. I don't remember where that was at exactly. Oh, that was the guy that had like the metal pipe. Okay. The, ele the elevator in the Valley of the Damned isn't working. A gear is missing. Alright, let's start with this one. Why is there an orange thing? Is that because it's a... Oh, so these are... No. So that's the quest guy that I'll eventually need to return to, I guess. And I need to find Alvar, who is up somewhere, maybe around the stronghold at the top of town. Okay. It all makes sense in some fashion or another. Yeah, well, we handled business. We got some stuff done. Feeling pretty good about this. I do still want to go slap Drog around, but I can't do it yet. I'm not strong enough, clearly. Clearly not strong enough, but eh, we'll see. We'll see. At some point, I'm sure we'll manage it. Alright. If I run into you? No, it didn't knock it down. I think that used to be a thing. You could like bump into people and it would knock stuff down. I think Assassin's Creed did that as well. Don't 
don't try anything. Well, what am I gonna try? Why you get all all uppity, huh? Make me whip out my weapon and beat you. Oh, good, they're gonna leave. Yeah, why don't you just go and do other things while I walk into a wall? Because I'm really good at my job. Walking. Who does that kind of stuff? Not this guy. You dirty thief. Uh oh. Apparently I was seen committing a crime. Well, I'm just gonna casually stand over here and see what happens. I don't know who saw me. I, I thought I was like even blocked from view. There was nobody else in the room. Not like that. Oh. Oh boy. Are you guys over it? Are we friends now? You're upset. You're always upset. You're upset too. You know who's not upset? I do. Ah, oh, why did you? No. Don't think you can steal anything here. Oh, I would never think to do anything like that. While you guys are taking that nice slow climb up here, guess what? I'm not going to be doing up here. That's right. I am not going to be stealing any arrows at all. Not a single solitary one. All right, cool. Anyway, now that I've severely upset her with her amazing, cool, glowing sword that I'm absolutely 100% jealous of, um, yeah, we're just gonna casually walk away because, you know, of course we are. Uh, we gotta go up to town or uptown a little, like literally up the town a bit more. So I'm sure there's gonna be some stuff down here that we haven't done, and I'm sure there's gonna be some stuff up there that we're gonna end up seeing or not seeing that we should or shouldn't see. I don't know. It's going to be a thing, so if I recall correctly, going uptown is to my left, yeah. Stop using that here, this is no place for technology. I, that, I just, it was really bad gas, I had like, last night was burrito night, you guys know, we had beans, I couldn't help it. Beans and there's just a touch of magic and, you know, boom, jetpack, what can I say? Alright, I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, what's over here? Actually, what's in here? You know how good of a thief I am at this point. Oh, there's arrows. Oh gosh, there's a person right outside that window. You know, if you're like a, a healer, you shouldn't have arrows laying around. People could roll over and like reach for a drink or something, and then all of a sudden, boom, they impaled their hand on an arrow. And then you have a new thing that you're going to have to, you know, heal. I'm just... I'm decluttering right now. I feel like you have too much stuff just laying around. Ooh, an exile's journal? Cool. Kata's journal. Well, no, I'm not sure where Kata is. Honestly, right now, I don't want to know. But I'm about to do something stupid. Again. I did get caught already. It was not the end of the world. Alright. Welcome. No. Nope. Welcome to... No. Really? Yeah, I think I'm done here. We Too did it. Easy. I say welcome to uh, lock picking. It's very similar to how I believe Risen One did it, and probably all the Risens. I don't remember everything about the games, sadly, folks. Um, all I know is I did play through Risen One twice. I played one on camera. I actually did the full let's play of it. And then I also played on my own prior to that, so it's one of the few times. Stop there! You know you're wanted. Report to Ragnar now before things turn bad for you. Oh. Huh. Well, she just uh, actually did not know that I was wanted. I know I got caught I drown in their own shit. stealing something, but you know I'm sure we can make amends. I could be like, yeah, I, I accidentally uh, tripped and I knocked something off and then I, when I picked it up, they thought I was taking it. It's really just a big misunderstanding. Do not look at my pack and see all the stuff that I pilfered from you guys. No, right? Can I steal herbs too? Like, Don't mess me around or I'll mess with you. You're a healer. 
goods are the whole heart of trade. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I should probably talk to a. Yeah, I'll talk to a cure. Are you in need of medical supplies? Depends. It'll take time to prepare them, I'm afraid. With all the fighting, we haven't any stocks left. Haven't you? Do you help everyone who asks? It is a healer's duty, especially in these times of war. And it is needed, bitterly. Which is what I have heard from everyone we picked up. Terrible. I wish I could offer aid to all those in need. But it seems not even our magic helps us keep up with supplies. Well, can you heal my wounds? Can you heal my wounds? Let me have a look. You don't seem to have any broken bones. Here, I think this will aid you. Sweet. Um, not gonna work. All right, thank you. Thank you. We are here to heal. Besides, the more people who can patch themselves up, the less time we'll have to spend picking up the pieces. You must hear a lot about what's going on. I don't need to hear. I get to see the results. That's fair. The magic the Alves are using is so destructive. Somehow they're managing to use pure Elex, and it makes me fear for our warriors. It's more powerful than Berserker magic? It's more destructive. With the damage it's causing, I can't believe it isn't tearing the Alves apart, too. Huh. It must hurt them. Hurt? Yes. But they're trained to reject emotions and feelings. Yes. They say Elex makes machines of men. Uh, yeah. But I have heard there are Alps who have escaped their addiction. Nice. I wish I could meet one. Knowing what they feel might help me assist others to overcome their addiction. Well, what do you know about... Yeah. What do you know about Elex withdrawal? I met an Alp separatist. He was brought in as a prisoner. His external wounds weren't so bad, but internally, emotionally... He was trying to cope with all those withdrawal symptoms, and at the same time, he was rediscovering his emotions. All that pain. All that confusion. What happened to him? Where is he? He died. Oh. It was all just too much. I wish I could have learned more from him. If he could leave, so could others. Maybe that could offer hope to us all. That's fair. Well, thank you for your insightfulness. Apparently I'm wanted and I now have to go and turn myself in. That's going to be super fantastic. Well, let's get that done before we run out of time. Hey. Oh. Did you know there were some weapons brought back here to Goliath? Maybe. Energy weapons taken from the clerics? No. I'd be interested in getting a look at them. If you know how, I could get a chance to do that. What are you insinuating? Yeah, you should be careful, buddy. Be careful. You know I could get you exiled for even asking about that. Yes, of course. Sorry, I didn't mean it like that. Listen, what I need is some help. Let's be straight. You recently tracked down a pair of cleric weapons, didn't you? What's that a pair? accusation? This is a small town with lots of big mouths. There aren't really that many secrets. So, have you given those weapons over to the pit? Or... Do you still have them? Did you see that lady that walked by? She had a gun. Who would be what was happy that? To pay for them. The berserkers don't want them. The clerics do. Um, I can't give you the weapons. What will you pay me for them? What will you pay me for them? Of course, of course. I can offer you Alexa if you give them to me. That would only be fair. I suppose. And should you wish to learn more about technology, I could point you to where answers can be found. Sure. I'll sell the weapons to you. Sell? No. Think of this as a finder's fee. I'll make sure these get back to the right place. Okay. Well, we'll talk to you more later. Bertram. We have to remember him. Because he's going to be our key to joining the clerics. Chances are we'll end up joining the Zerks first, but... Yeah, we're probably going to end up joining the clerics later. That's That seems to be the consensus, though it's evening up a bit as we go. And that's pretty cool. But, yeah, I'm still, I'm still adding my own vote in there, so it's like... It's either 3 or 4 to 3. Or, sorry. It was, it was like 2 to 1, and now I think it's like 4 to 2. 
I think it's how it's working. Took the hammer. Is there anyone in here? No. You dirty thief. Oh, son of a Ouch. I meant to do that. Well, that's just the worst. I looked too. You saw I looked around. Oh, good. I talked to her. Okay. Well, I guess that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and get this plant. Hey. Bertram, be careful. Yeah, listen, is, blah, listen, blah, 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 so blah, blah. Uh, what? Of and I'll sell the weapons to I'll you. So somebody no, won't like that. Think of this as a. I'll make sure the. I really wanted those weapons though, so that kind of, kind of sucks. All right. So I, I guess we'll just randomly roll around because of no reason. We're, we're just going to try to stay a little bit more focused. I'm sorry I get so off track so quickly. Like who walked over here and saw me? I, I don't... I don't understand. I can't help it, it's a compulsion. So just a random chick just like, hey, I'm gonna go into this house now. From nowhere, she doesn't exist. She's not even a real person. I don't, I don't understand. Oh, look at all the stuff I get to loot. Uh, so good. All right. So let's go turn ourselves in. I guess we're getting pretty close to where we need to be. Who are you, friend? Oh, it's Duras. Oh, I bet he's gonna be angry with me. All right, let's talk to him. So you decided to stick around. I have a lot of choices. Well, I've been given a job by a warlord Ragnar that I think might suit you. Ooh. If you want to stay around for longer. Um, sure. Tell me about the job, tell buddy. Me about the job. Well, the task I have on offer should profit you, and though it's not the best way to sell our community to you, it should demonstrate that we're open about things here. You see, there was a murder committed just outside Goliath a few months Ooh. ago. A rather dedicated berserker named Ascor was killed. There's been an investigation, but no definitive answers as to why he was killed. So, Ragnar wants me to follow up and find the murderer. Cool. And what can I do? Well... I'm having trouble getting answers from people. Maybe an outsider will have more success getting them to open up. Would you talk to the suspects and see what they have to say? Yeah, I will. Um, I'm going to say end right now. We're going to break off the episode here. We're going to make it a little bit of a shorter one. And then in the next episode, we'll continue. We'll start our, I guess, murder investigation. Hear all about that. And we'll go turn ourselves in for being a thief because, of course, we're terrible people and it's what we do. And yeah, all that wonderful, fun stuff. Oh, looks like the guards are coming to talk to Duras. Anyway, folks, until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>